So recently, I've came across this article about how Bill Gates are stepping in to help with the coronavirus. I thought that was a very noble act of him. Good job, Bill Gates. No homo. Because of that, I've decided to give Bill Gates another chance. So this time we're going to do another Windows Crack Me. This Crack Me is from DTM again. Our goal is to achieve full version of the software. As always, I already have it downloaded. So let's run it and see how it goes. So there's a demo version. Demo version. So we can type something. And there's a save function. Let's try to save it. So the save button doesn't work until we register it. Then the register key. This doesn't work. Invalid serial number. Registration failed. Okay, so last time we used IDA and it was a bit too easy. So this time I decided to try Cutter, which is the graphical interface version of Radara. As always, we start with strings. Try and find the strings of, say, registration succeed. Oh, registration successful. Here we go. So in here, this is a string. Let's take a look and see what it's called. Show the X reference. And it was called in here. If I'm correct, this should be a fairly easy one. We just have to change this jump equal into jump not equal. And we'll go through here instead when you come test compare. Okay. Anyway, so let's try it. Edit. Uh, reverse jump. Reopen. Okay. Nice. So now we try and save it. Now that we have reversed the instruction, we can try and register. Say anything. Ah, oh, it works. So we can try and save some files. Oh, there's a lot of games in here. Which reminds me, I gotta go play games now. So, I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye. Eh? Why is Bill Gates unhappy? Let's check the requirement again. Oh, there's a secondary goal. The secondary goal, optional, is to make the registration persistent. If we go ahead and take a look at this program, so it works now. If we reopen it, it's a demo version again, and we have to retype the key in. Looks like that's the reason why Bill Gates is not impressed. So we're gonna try and make it persistent. So the main reason that we are in the editor right now is because when I was editing, I realized that I forgot to record the audio. So there's literally only video from this point onwards, there's no sound into it, so I'll just quickly go through what I did in here. So my first approach was to find the spot where it checks whether you register or not, but I couldn't find it in the disassembler. So I kind of cheated a bit. Instead of pushing the demo text in, I just pushed the full licensed version text in so that it will show on the text bar on top. As for the save, I just reversed the jump and it worked. After a few hours of hard work, finally managed to crack it. So if we take a look here now, you can see the demo version is gone. That was supposed to be here, it's gone. If we want to save file, we can save files. Now let's see if Bill Gates is impressed. 